Hey there. So here's a way we can use our pro pole device to work on hip rotation strength. So this is really nice because we just keep this set up just like we would be using the pro pole. Unhook the disc. We don't need that for this purpose. What we're going to do, we're going to take the carabiner, you're going to hook it on your back belt loop. Okay, as you can see here, pulling my pants to the side, right? So what I'm going to do is from here, I'm going to turn around. I'll do that again. So I want you to turn towards your right side if you're a right-handed disc golfer. So then the band ends up in front of my body. So from here, you can imagine that this comes in front of my body from the back. So it's turning my hips this way, opening my hips to the back. So from here, a couple things we can work on in terms of our timing and our hip position. First one's going to be isolate. Second one's gonna be integrate. So isolate, I like to say I'm holding this towel in front of my body. I'm in a slight flexed over position. And I may have to step out a little bit more or put another band on there just to feel a little bit. I feel a little bit of assistance going this way and resistance going this way. And that's what I'm looking for right now. I can make this a little bit harder by going a little bit further into a stretch, but I'm trying to isolate hip movement first, just to get the feeling of hips moving without shoulders moving. And that's going to strengthen up my core and strengthen up my hips. Then we want to integrate it. And I want to try to start to do some movement with that feeling. So we can do the old towel drill here where I can do my reach back and then go. And this will give me a little resistance in my hip position. So that's a nice way that we can try to get some hip integration, some hip and core strengthening using our pro pull device. Um, other considerations. So while you have this hooked up, again, it wants to twist me and slide me to the side. So it's really good in terms of core and hip activation, having this thing here. So I can do something simple like standing on one foot and it's kind of difficult. So if I stand on one foot, it's trying to rotate me and pull me off balance. Really nice way to work on balance. So some of my runners or some of my other athletes, I'll actually have them work on marches to promote stability of that outer hip, or we can work on squats with a rotation and a shift being applied by this band. So that's a different way to get stronger with a little bit of rotation and glide aspect. Give that a try. Hope that'll help you to throw well.